Costa Rica, we organize children elections, as you know, which are held the same day of the adults general elections. We do this to teach our children the importance of democracy mm -hmm. and to build a thriving civic culture. Well, in, in, in the two, uh, 2014 presidential elections, I won the children's election by a wider margin than the others' elections. Oh, wow. That uh, result stayed very close to my heart, of course. And that is why I decided soon after winning to visit some of the schools to greet and thank the children. When I arrived to one of the schools, the teachers gave me some beautiful news. The day after I was elected president, several girls announced that they will run for president huh? in their school and high school elections. Later, during my presidency, I visited again, uh, you know, some schools and kindergarten, and in an incredible entertaining, in one of those visits, uh, an entertaining exchange with five-year-old children, I asked them if they would like to become president of Costa Rica. Surprisingly, only girls raised their hand. When I asked one of the boys if he would like to become president one day, his reply was, in order to become a president, you have to be a woman. <laughs> yeah, so at that time, Laura, I became fully aware of the extent of my decision to uh, run for president, to change forever my country's understanding of women's participation in politics.